Hello everyone, welcome back to higher mathematics. Today we have an interesting integral. What is the undefined integral of the function square root of x times square root of x? So how can you solve this? On the first side, this integral is really hard because we have two square roots, but we have only our x, so this is good for us. So what I recommend is to write this square root sign using a in other way. So let's write this square root of x as x to the power one half. So we can do this. Let's write this x to the power one half. So this square root will be power one half. And this square root will be power one half as well. So as a result we will have that this square root we can write as x square root of x all raised to the power one half dx. So we write this square root sign but we write it here one half. So what we're we going to do next? We all know that if we raise a product to the power we need to raise every of these both of x and square root of x to this power. So as a result we will have that this will be equal to integral this x to the power one half and right here we have x to the power one half and raised to the power one half. So we need to multiply this this one half and this one half and as a result we will have x to the power one fourth times x to the power one fourth dx. And take a look, it's really good case because we have the same bases, we have a product, so if we want to write it in one base we need to add these powers, one half plus one fourth. As a result we will have that this integral will be equal to integral of x and if we add one half plus one fourth we will have three fourths. Three fourths dx. And this is our classic case, but instead of like a simple x square that is pretty good to find integral, we have a fraction. We have 3 over 4, so nothing change. We find using a rule that we want, that we know, x to the power 3 half dx. Integrate this. It will be equal to x to the power 3 half plus 1, and we divide by this 3 half plus 1 and plus c. And the last step, let's simplify this, let's add this 3 fourths plus 1, we will have x to the power 7 fourths and dividing by this 7 fourths and plus c. Just add this, just simplify this. We can find, we can simplify this more because we have 7 fourths if we divide this, this 4 jump to our nominator. And as a result we will have the final answer 4 times x to the power 7 over 4 over 7 and plus c. And this will be our answer. If you have any question, if you have any suggestion, maybe you have faster method how to solve it, write your suggestion in the comment, write your question in the comment. Thank you for watching and see you in the next videos.